Hello, my name is Jonathan, and today we're going to create an Outlook profile in Windows 10 for a hosted exchange mailbox with ActiveSync enabled. If you have an Office 365 mailbox, you can check out my other video for that process. Outlook profiles become corrupt for millions of reasons. Sometimes you get various error messages, or sometimes a feature within Outlook will stop working correctly. Nine times out of 10, it's because the profile has become corrupt. And nine times out of 10, creating a new Outlook profile will fix this issue. In this video, we're going to show you how to create the new profile within Outlook. So we have something going wrong with Outlook, some features not working or something's not working correctly. So we're going to need to create a new profile. We'll click File at the top left, and then Account Settings, and then scroll down to Manage Profiles. You might have to click Yes on this pop-up. And then we're going to click on Show Profiles, Add, and then name the profile. It can't be an existing profile name, so I'm just going to go New Outlook. Click OK. Should bring us to the Add Account page. So we'll add in our information here. So first name, email address. So we're going to put in your email address here. And then your password. And you just want to retype your password here. Click Next. It's going to connect to the server, ask us for our credential again. So put in your password and you can either check or uncheck. Remember my credentials up to you. Click OK. All right. And we added it and we can click finish. But then from here, it's going to default to always use this profile and it's going to do the old one. So we can either select this so that when we launch Outlook, it prompts us or select this and select the new profile, hit apply and OK. And there you go. Created a new Outlook profile through Outlook itself. I hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.